Good afternoon. Greetings from South Georgia, USA. Out here in the field, doing a little chipping practice. I call this chipping at the giant's helmet. I have a giant's helmet out here. It's June the 14th, by the way. I have a giant's helmet out here in the field. The giant is no longer alive. King David killed Goliath, so all we have is his helmet. Show him the helmet, Debbie. The giant's helmet, it's turned upside down, and I like to use it to do chipping practice. All right, so I'm gonna show you how going to show you how I like to do this and this is something that I just say it works good for me you might want to first thing I do is I get my couple of practice notice my elbow stays here on my hip now the secret to this is pausing at the top. And you pause to the, as far back as you think it would take to make a, a very small stroke. I'm stopping there. Pause, and then I hit. Goes for a full swing too. All right, chipping at the giant's helmet. And you will hear it if it hits it It'll ring. Not only did it ring, it hit inside the giant's helmet and automatically pushed it, uh, bounced it back. It's like an automatic return. Chipping to the giant's helmet, a couple of, notice my knees, this one out, this one forward. Go about this far. Now if I was going further, I'd go this far. Something you're going to have to learn. Chipping at the giant's helmet. I missed that one. Let's do this. Do a couple of practice moves. Hit it that time. I don't know if you heard it ring. There it comes back again. That one bounced off the back edge inside of the giant's helmet and came back to me. didn't go in it, but it went and hit it. That one got in it. Now this is something that I couldn't do nearly as good until I learned to pause. I missed it. I was off line. Oh, I was just over it. Oh, I was just over it. <laughs> I'm not hitting it every time, but I'm getting darn close. Hit it that time. Hit 
it at that time. That one actually went in. Oh, I just barely missed it. All right, we're going to pause just a second. Go ahead. All right, that um, chip shot is a little bitty full swing. If I want to hit it harder, I do my little punch the knees. Elbow stays there on the hip. Want to hit it harder? Pause. Go back further. Further. And pause. And come down on the ball. Okay, here we go. Beautiful shot. Now it helps me a lot to... Do a couple of practice swings. Good shot. I need to come down on the ball just a little bit deeper. Oh, by the way, this, I'll show you this club. This is a ping O-sized I-3 orange dot. This is the first golf clubs I ever bought. The weight that goes in them is missing on this one. I never could notice the difference. I just got online and put this set of golf clubs in eBay and there just happened to be a complete set of these clubs for sale. I would say in mint condition. Still had the original plastic uh, wrapper on this part right here that, that said what it was. Original grips, everything. I bought them. These are the first clubs I ever bought. And uh, $199 for the whole set in mint condition. For nostalgia, I don't know. I don't think they made any better. So I'll be showing those to you. Here we go. Work the legs, get the feel. Pause at the top. One more. I'm going to hit one more. Pause, down. Pause, down. Pause, down. Couldn't hit a better shot. All right, we're going to train the camera on the Giants helmet right here. And that is reminiscent of the helmet that Goliath wore when the boy shepherd, King David, slew him with a shot from his nine iron. I mean his sling. I'd like to say the Lord's Prayer to end this golf session. Would you say it with us? Our Father, Father who, who art in heaven, heaven hallowed, hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come, thy, thy will be done, on earth as, as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Amen.